Hey, what is up? So the time is now, obviously a day late, two days late, uh, that we're going to do the draw. And I'm going to knock it out kind of quick, just so you don't have to wait forever, because it's, <laughs> it's also storming and I got a class to take. So, Oh, and I got bit by something today. I went to war with uh, stuff and uh, yeah, uh, I got bit by something. I don't know what it was. I think it was a bee. I got stung. Bump the thing out, but I, it could have been a spider bite. I don't know. Whatever it is, is like the size of a, it's the size of a dime, and it itches all the time. Hey, we got, we got the DZs, we got, we got Stu and Prexy Girl, and we got Trudy, we got BFB, we got Mike, we got Robinson Prospect, Mark, Mark Mitchell, Reg. Wayne, we got everybody in the house already. That's awesome, man. We are going to go ahead and start drawing uh, for some of these fantastic prizes. Um, well, let's just go over those first, though. We've got Joey's Dirt, round two. Joey's first dirt was pretty awesome. I'm sure Trudy can attest. We've got uh, Gibby's a Treasures bag donated by Gibby's Treasures, won it on the auction. We've got an uh, ounce of silver. Donated uh, from the auction from Jonathan Friend. And we've got the one ounce prospector, which I forgot was in here. One ounce of silver. We've got the the little crystal and silver set, is what I'm calling it. I called it the gems set. You got a little Merc dime and some um, crystals. I'm calling that gem and crystal set or silver set, gems and silver. And that's it. Oh, I'm lying. We still got that. Morgan Savadana. All right. So we've got the other. Uh, We're gonna bookend it. We're gonna start off with the Morgan because it's a nice prize. And then we're gonna end it with the dirt. We're gonna bookend it with two good prizes. We got a whole bunch of folks here. And I'm sorry on my last video, I know I said somewhere along through there that I was going to do a draw at the end and I didn't because I wanted to get to this uh, sort of quickly. But something new to the channel, new and uh, not really new to me, but new to the channel. Um, I have become an ambassador with a company. Uh, I had to, to give it a pretty good test trial before they ever approved me, which, which actually ended up being better than worse, uh, because I can actually say with confidence that the products have been really awesome. Um, do you guys know I partake in the cardinal sin of energy drinks? Uh, and let's just say some of them are far worse for you than others. Um, None of them are probably, uh, you know, great for you, um, but I have found one that I believe to be the best I've ever had in my lifetime. And it just so happens that uh, they sponsor content creators, um, not really sponsor, but give you a affiliate link, which allows you to make money, I guess. So it's kind of like sponsor, but it's really, they make you an ambassador. And I'm totally rambling, uh, but they're also a uh health and wellness company, which is great because I recently started dieting, which none of you probably have noticed yet, but I've started kind of dieting. Okay. And I'm starting to work out again, starting to feel better and do better. And so they've got some pre-workout. They've got some stuff to help me sleep, which is look at me. <laughs> it's 10 o'clock or nine o'clock at night. And I'm actually ready to go to bed. Uh, that's because I'm actually doing things that make sense. Uh, but in the description, there is a uh, affiliate link. You can go to that and a portion of your total order will come back to me. Uh, so I would appreciate that. If you are a partaker of the energy product or, you know, you work out, you need some, some uh, pre-workout, anything like that, go check it out. And I appreciate it. Uh, with that said, I consume of those products that they offer, the ones that are my favorite, sour gummy worms, flavored energy drinks. Um, these 
I'll just grab these. These are like super awesome. So these go pouches and this pre-workout is my favorite. It's that one. You can read it. It's like punch. Pretty good stuff. This is another good one too. This one, honestly, I hate to even say this, but this one reminds me of the, the not because it's an R, but the flavor. It's kind of like the rocks are strawberry guava. It's really good, uh, but that's better because no crash, no crash, no crash, no crash. I used to be part of another company and uh, they had that same, that was their motto was no crash. So energy without the crash, best thing ever. Anyway, so eating watermelon. I want some watermelon. That's not even fair. Two videos in the same hour. <laughs> yeah. And by the way, we have over 475 videos. Isn't that something? 475 videos I've created in two and a half years. Insane in the membrane. Um, so we're going to draw that Morgan Silver Dollar. We got Mama DZ, we got Wife DZ, and we got Stu DZ. <laughs> and the winner, the winner of the Morgan Silver Dollar, Susan Bedusen. You have a very nice coin to add to your collection. I don't see you in the comments yet, but you are probably extremely excited about this when you get it, if you're not here. This is incredible, and you are well-deserving. You always contribute, and you may have been the top contributor. I do not know off the top of my head. To be honest, this week has been a blur, but I have so many things to get shipped out tomorrow. Thank you so much to all of you who have, have participated in this, but also been buying dirt. Um, I know they basically almost have stock again, which is okay. We sold out of the Dominican dream at the show. So that won't be back for a bit. Sorry for those of you who really wanted to and didn't get it. Um, but we will have more. Um, and uh, I know uh, yeah, I, if you guys aren't aware, a bunch of hurricanes are hitting down there where Jason lives. And so he's going to get back or have hit. And now he's going to go back and take care of that stuff. So he's on his way home. And uh, and I, if, you, if you're uh, a prey type, Please pray for him and his family as they get, you know, get their get to the get to the grindstone. Um, I he's not here in the comments, so I want to say we will probably undoubtedly do do something here in the very near future for him. Don't tell him I said this. Hopefully, he don't watch this live stream. But I really do want to help him and his family because he's a big part of this community, and I know he is. He's got a lot on his plate to go back down there and rebuild. Um, so if you guys have any ideas, let me know. Um, I would love to do something for him and his family as he has always been a big contributor to all, all that we've all been a part of. So um, his family, like I said, they went through a couple of hurricanes. I know his aunt, his aunt's house, some, one of his family members house was actually pretty well destroyed. Uh, and obviously, you know, it's a, it's an island. It's their world country. They really don't have the resources. Uh, we've got a pandemic going on. I can't even imagine what's going on down there. But let's let's uh, let's get back to uh, the draw. Um, so, but again, if you guys have any ideas, please let me know. We did a pen kit bag yesterday. 0.115, always above the minimum. Well, that's good to know. Uh, that was cutting it close though. So uh, I'm glad it was above the minimum. My scale must have been off. I always try to get some more over the minimum than that. I would like to, to have more over the minimum. Uh, Dina Mark, there's a song that comes to my mind. I don't know if New Yorkers listen to country music, but I drive your truck. That's a song that came to mind too, that I lost a bunch of friends, obviously, um, in the military and, 
And one of them was my best friend who taught me how to drive in a Ford Ranger. Uh, unfortunately, he's a victim of this right here, too. We grew up together and he taught me how to drive because he was too tired. And we worked third shift after high school, which we weren't supposed to do at 16 years old, but we did anyway. Absolutely. Everybody go to Black Mass Paydirts and get yourself some of that good stuff Jonathan's got going on over there. Uh, if you live west of the Mississippi, no kidding, Jonathan sells the same sluice boxes, and I would appreciate if you buy them from him if you live west of the Mississippi. <laughs> nice. I'm the same way, Dina, exact same way. Though I may not portray one, I am one in real life. <laughs> I wish I was a better one, though. Um, I thought I meant to say, though, I don't always portray one, meaning I'm not a, always the best reflection. Um, all right. Like, hey, Thomas Anderson, how are you doing? And I'm going to say it one more time, everybody go to blackmasspaydirts.com. Check out Jonathan's website. He's been working hard for a long time uh, to get that stuff going. And he has plenty in stock and uh, he will treat you right. I've done reviews of his, his pater before. He's always done very well. All right, so let's go ahead and draw the next prize. The next prize is going to be the grab bag donated by Gibby's Treasures. So thank you so much, Gibby's Treasures for not only winning the auction that you got in here, and I'm not going to tell you what's in here because I forget and I'm not going to open the bag, uh, but it is a coin grab bag that Gibby's Treasures won. Uh, I believe Gibby's Treasures paid 10 bucks for it and uh, they uh, won. So you win now. <laughs> Here's what we're going to do. We're going to find out who wins the bag from Gibby's Treasures. If it's Trudy, it'd be ironic because some of them coins are from over there, <laughs> from your continent. Well, maybe not, maybe not your specific continent, but I know some of them are from over there. Um, well, yeah, it would be Europe, duh. <laughs> Rome is in Europe, I don't know what I'm thinking. I don't know who I'm talking to, what I'm talking about. And, uh, Trudy, <laughs> I kid you not, Trudy Taylor. <laughs> Congrats, Trudy. You won. And uh, the only, like I said, the only reason I know what's in here uh, without opening it. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What's that thing? What is that thing? Is that silver view? No, that might not be silver. Is it silver? Yeah. yeah there's, there's a silver proof Roosevelt Valley Trudy. It is immaculate. It's beautiful. But there's a Roman coin in there in this graded coin holder. So I know that was from Europe. This is Roman. Uh, All right, so the next thing we're going to give away actually is from Jonathan Friend, who donated a he, – he bid on this. This is one ounce of silver. It is a fractional pound of that uh, the coin store broke or somebody broke it. And it's all four, uh, all four pieces of the pie, so to speak. Uh, but it was donated by Black Mass Paydirt. So, again, let's go show them some love and thank them by going to their website, blackmasspaydirt.com. And get yourself some pater. Jonathan, if you want to go ahead and put that in the comment section, your website, link to your website, you go right ahead. Um, that was Trudy. Trudy won. And Trudy's been donating a lot. So Trudy, well-deserved. And yes, that's well-deserved. So now let's get right into it. Silver, 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 silver. Yeah, it is. A, it totally is a pie coin. Brexy girl, look at this. Except I won't be able to put it together because... Uh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, 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 look at this. I can do it. I got this because I can. My hands work. Oh, this. Wait a minute. That ain't right. That can't be right. Where is it at? Let's just go here. Okay, so when I said I think I can do this, I should have thought more. Eureka. Yeah. Uh, okay, so this one goes this way aha i got it i got this mad scientist 
Yeah. Okay. So I just wasted 37 seconds of my life that I can't get back. Is that kind of what you, yeah, there we go. Kind of something like that. It's round again. But yeah, so there's that. Um, Let's fix that problem. Jonathan Friend is now moderator of your channel. There you go. BFB, you're making me so hungry, and I'm trying to not eat so much because, well, I bake too much. <laughs> I did make amazing, amazing food tonight, though. It has... Um, the last of our zucchini, so our zucchini is all gone, I think, unless it's like fell into the back of the freezer or something. So zucchini, um, um, zucchini, <laughs> cauliflower, spaghetti sauce, and um, mild sausage. And when you mix that all up, it's delicious and low carbs. Oh, shoot. Monster. There you go, Jonathan Friend. Congratulations. Welcome to the club. Um, and the winner of the Pater is Joey. No. <laughs> what if you do win, Joey? You'll get your Pater back. Zucchini is amazing. So is cauliflower. And so is all them vegetables. Hey, they're delicious. When you put spaghetti sauce on them. <laughs> Um, so I used to make my own spaghetti sauce, which didn't have any sugar in it. Um, let's see here. I'm just kidding, by the way, Joey. Sorry. I was just kidding. Totally kidding. I did not draw that yet. That'd be last. Couldn't afford any entries. That's why I was taking too much money. But you know what? Soon enough, soon enough, Ray, you will be cracking rocks. Wait a minute. Uh, mineralized rocks <laughs> and getting that shiny stuff out and you will be loaded to the hills with lots and lots and lots of Canadian scents. If you guys didn't see that last video I just posted, I felt pretty, pretty sad that I didn't come up with that as a real joke. It was just kind of came out and I was like, wow, why didn't I think of that as a joke? It was great because I got a lot of Canadian cents, which they use no longer in Canada. They don't use cents. It's like five cents and above, right, Reg? So it was actually a lot of joke, but it was hilarious. And so the winner of the one ounce of silver is. Nope. Robert K. And I don't think he's here. I'm not seeing Robert K. But congratulations, Robert K. You won the pie coin as Per Prexy Girl, Robert K. I can't pronounce his last name or I would try. I think, actually, I won't try because I don't know what his YouTube name is. And if his YouTube name ain't the same as his regular name, I don't want to say it. Next up, we're going to do the gems. We've got a nice semi terminated quartz crystal, a really big one. And then this red thing, which I'm not 100% positive, but it's cut off the host rock, it's been sawed off the host rock, and it's very pretty. And then a silver mercury diamond. This was donated by Joey E. in the comments. Thank him so much. Good night, Robinson Prospecting. So good to finally meet you. And I wish I would have took some sluices home. I regret it and have totally regretted it since. Um, Let's see here. So this is again donated by Joey E in the comment section. Good night, BK Gold. That is a very great dime. Definitely AU.
very, very great dime. All right, so it's going to go to who? Oh, are you on? Jonathan Friend, congratulations. You, sir, are the proud new owner of a gem kit here. You got a gem and another gem. I think you're, maybe your wife will like this pink one. I know that's your favorite color, too, but maybe you'd be nice and give it to your wife, Jonathan. <laughs> it's like a, almost like kind of like a geode, I think. I really don't know what it is, if it's garnet or I don't know. It's pretty. Super pretty. The grown man saying super pretty. That's what you guys came to see, right? And a really, really nice 1941 Merc. Liberty head down. Very nice, very nice. And this quartz crystal is huge. And you can see, you'll, you'll appreciate it, Jonathan, because I know you like to get out in the, into nature. You can see where another one popped out right there. It's got that perfect shape like that right there. It's pretty cool. So that is Jonathan Friends. But he's really only here for the Morgan and the dirt. I know Jonathan. And he lost out on that first Morgan. So we're getting some uh, lag. Sorry about that. All right. Now, for the not yet Pied Pie coin, the not yet divided, still united, one ounce silver prospector, one day, LBPA, one day. <laughs> you know, you know, none of them are in here. Um, who's going to win the silver? Because I already know, but do you know? I don't think you guys know, but I know. <laughs> Jonathan Friend, congratulations. You win again. <laughs> Jonathan Friend donated a pie coin. And then, well, he won. He won so first and foremost, he bid on this in an auction and won it. Donated it to this and then won its full brother. So congrats, Jonathan. That is a great add to your stack. You got a nice little stack going on over there now. All right, so who's next? Who's next? What's next, actually, for that matter? What's next? We've got the pan kit from Tom'sGoldDirt.com. The pan kit from Tom'sGoldDirt.com. Who's it going to be? I know, but you don't. Who's it going to be? TR. TR is not even here, I don't think. TR, are you in the house? TR. Congrats, TR. And we're down to the last but not least prize, the bell of the ball. I don't know where it went. Um, what Are you kidding me? <laughs> Donated a broken one and got a whole one. That's right. Where's TR? TR's not here. Oh, yeah, here's the bell of the ball. Trudy's going to win this because it's going to cost the most to ship across these. Actually, if Trudy did win something, though, so that's great. Um, and then I got to send Trudy her other prizes that she won anyway, so it'll all work out in the end. Um, is this gonna, did you guys all just want to donate this to me? I mean, that would be, you know, super nice. I know there's also something else in here that I would like to have. So nice. Just so nice. Anyway, so let's find out who wins because this is going to be awesome. And everybody, first and foremost, everybody go in that comment section and say, thank you, Joey Akins. Because if not for Joey Akins, he's right there. He's got the orange, the orange color. He's Joey, and he donated a lot of these prizes. In fact, he donated one, two, three, four, five prizes. One, no, wait. I did terrible math. Four. But he also gave me some gifts, so those don't count. But they, they were donated for this. So thanks again, Joey. Oh, yeah, and you guys are probably curious to know. Where are we at in the world of donations? What did we do for a Klondike bar? <laughs> Joey was donating all the way to the last minute too. So Stu, Prexy Girl, and Dina, Joey really 
he, he hit this one out of the park for you guys. I just want you to know that. Joey's a veteran, and he is pretty passionate about veterans, too. Oh, yeah, I am totally stalling. I'm trying to do math. Can't hardly see my screens like so little. Not too bad, not too bad. I gotta do math though. I'm doing math in my head, so the smile might be bigger than the real reward, but we'll see here. That's it. Not too bad, not too bad. So uh, I'll have to figure shipping, but it's it's well over $200 that we're going to be donating. Help out. Uh, it's, uh, I'm not going to tell you until the end. So let's go ahead and do the draw. That's awesome. I said well over 200 I don't know where I'm going to tell you if I'm going to tell you. We'll see here. So I'm just gonna say it's 275 bucks because if shipping is is about you know what how many prizes is it? It's five bucks per prize. I'm gonna call it 275 bucks, which is one, two, three. Yeah, we're gonna do that. We're gonna go with that. And then Trudy's gonna win, so shipping is gonna be like three times that. But it's all good. It's all good. 275 bucks to the um, Mickey Keeney. Uh, final costs. Uh, what was I doing? I was doing something before I got all emotional and all excited about stuff. And then I forgot what I was getting ready to do. I totally, totally forgot. Um, what am I doing? Oh, I got a new pillow today. That's so nice. It's so nice. <laughs> Oh, hey, Gibby Treasures is here. Gibby, Gibby, uh, thanks for donating something that I now have to ship across seas. <laughs> Over yonder. Gibby donated it. Okay. That'll work. Uh, just send it. Actually, I think I have it because I think she's bought entries and pay, paid. So I just, it's probably, well, actually... Dina, if you want to send it, or, or Stu, if you want to send it, that's fine. It's a super, super heavy pillow, and it's got lots of gold in it. That makes it better, but I'll, I'll get to it. I'll quit. I'll quit. Oh, you guys want to see something else? Squirrel. <laughs> These are all my losers. I tried to win a dredge to send back to the Dominican. So I can get a whole bunch more gold. Now, nah, trying to win stuff. I didn't win stuff. I didn't win nothing, but... It helps the GPA continue to be an awesome organization to keep people like us prospecting. So what was I doing before I got all sidetracked? I think I was, I think I was getting ready to, to draw this number. I can't believe I won. I cannot believe I won. I cannot believe who won. <laughs> yeah, you won again, Trudy. I swear you are the luckiest person ever i cannot even believe that oh my gosh trudy taylor is the luckiest person on earth she won the last one of these that joey donated and i think joey put like joey you put like a lot of gold in that last one it was like huge 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 money worth of gold and this one is huge 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 money worth of gold 
uh, like I, I can't remember how much gold is in here, but I'm not going to tell you, but I know it's a lot. Um, insane, insane, insane. But Trudy really was, I think, the top contributor this time as well. Um, and uh, by all things, she is always, always winning it. So lucky. I don't even understand. The only unlucky person here right now is me. Because now I got to ship her a whole bunch of stuff. I'm just kidding. No, it's fantastic. I'm so glad Trudy wins. Yeah, let's uh, let's go ahead and write five dollars on that customs report. <laughs> hey, Joey, don't tell me how much is in it because I don't want to lie to the customs people. Hope they're not watching. <laughs> that is incredible. So exciting. And what's even more incredible is that we are sending $275 to hopefully really help your guys' family out. And, and just, I mean, <laughs> it's incredible. It's incredible. And before I get all emotional, I just want to say that uh, Stu and, and Mickey, uh, you know, I'm grateful for both of your service, obviously. And as better, and it's, it's tough, you know. I just, uh, my thoughts are with you guys and, and his, his family and his wife and kids. And anyway, um, I hope you all have a fantastic work week because now it's back to the real world. And uh, like I said, if you need a motivator in the morning, go get yourself some rep sports products. Uh, I will push them I'll come on because I really do believe in them now. I worked out for the first time three days ago. And then I worked out the day after that. So, uh, it is truly, uh, it's sad that I need a, a pre-workout just to get motivated to do a workout period, especially when my wife's got like all these apps on our Roku and she's always, you know, really into it. And I'm just like sitting around playing video games and making YouTube videos. And I feel ashamed of myself to say that, but Seriously, thank you so much, everybody, for helping us do yet again another fantastic thing for some fantastic folks. And uh, with that, gold luck, God bless, and I'll see you all in the next one.